Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Bet it was happy. Almost shot a rat. Martin Lee's really paying the boss? Yo, Rick! Boss wants to talk to you. Get in here! Yeah. We built need to get into that office. What are they building? Is this all for me? Careful. Hey, what was that? Easy does it. What kind of vehicle needs tires this big? Brave dust must have me on edge. Where is it? I swear I left it over here. <sighs> that guy's not going anywhere. Maybe I can distract him. Hardware? Hey, anyone pick up more gear after our last There's the office. A lot of men in the way, though. Seem important. Alchemax. Why is that so familiar? What's in these? Boss, come on. We'll never notice. <laughs> You're right, Rick. Won't notice? Cause it won't be there. God damn it! I said I'll fix it! You got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. a disappointment. And now I need a new welder. Building for Lee. But what? Here we go. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. 
Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the Great Dumpling Catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves devil's breath, whatever that is. Yeah. I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, what if we teamed up? What, what you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh, Oscorp CFO. Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did, did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just the couch is fine. <laughs> uh, see you later? Yeah. Spider-Man, shoot away. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? Chief Financial Officer at Oscorp, single, known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Because it sure feels like we are. Partners? Uh, sounds good. Okay. See ya, partner. Police look like they could use some help. How many who's there? Thanks for the assist, Spider-Man. Someone radio dispatch. We need a wagon. There's probably more of them inside. You guys stay here. Somebody was in a hurry. Spider-Man! You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish, fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse, top floor. Okay, sit tight. 
so glad you're here. I can't find my car. I could have sworn I parked on this level. You guys work here too? This building is serious about parking enforcement. Fight! A for effort! Elevator won't work, they know I'm here. But maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here. Touch it now! Okay, almost there. Stay out of the light. Nice and easy. Oh, building. Fire bombs? Seriously? Move! Uh oh, Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. Tasa, Sima, Yeti Kuda. 
He sounds nervous. Maybe I should take him out. Huh? Sleep it off. He literally didn't see that coming. Clear. Hope Standish is all right. Let's try this again. It's safe now. What were they after? Just financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. On a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
You okay? Yeah. I think so. Good. Good. You know, as elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. <laughs> hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah. But I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right. Whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean... Spider Cop? Uh, Yuri? That's fair. What happened with Standish? He's safe. Okay, good. And the demons? They were looking for a name. You got a pen? Yeah, go. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Okay. Who is he? What's his deal? I was hoping you could tell me. Come on, just give me a few. Oh, and before I forget, you left that tracker from Tombstones at my place. I'll drop it at Dr. Octavius' lab. I'll let you know what I find on Delaney. A bus full of civilians was just taken hostage. Need immediate response at Union Square. Our brothers are guilty only of fighting for a new and better world! Keep it up, Spidey! Hey, do you have time to check something out for me? No, but if you ask nicely... I just got a call about a suspicious-looking box on a rooftop in Hell's Kitchen. I could call in the bomb squad, but if it's just some kid's science project... Yeah, I know. Budget crisis, yada, yada, yada. So... <sighs> Will you... please... check it out? There's the magic word. I hope it's some kid's science project. Man, I miss those days. The school projects are so much easier than real life projects. Great. Weird. Spider-Man, so you found one of my recon points. Who is this? Wrong question. The correct one is, can you stop the bombs I've planted? Mystery Man's got recon points spread all over the city. This computer's tracking bombs around the district, and they're about to go off. I gotta move. Be quick. Bombs could go off any second. My 
web muffled it pretty well. close to perfection. MJ, what did you find out about Isaac Delaney? Check out the picture I just sent. Which one is Delaney? I don't know. Guess you'll have to go to the party to find out. Good thing I already have a costume. Agents, this is Control. What's the situation in Longacre? Demons are attacking Outpost Romeo. Send backup. dressed as one of my greatest foes. Let's find out which one. Why you guys gotta be so nasty? Everyone's in costume. My people. Now there's a guy who puts in the effort. Badass. That job offer in Delaware came Hey, look at us! We're spider bros! Check out my moves! <laughs> Excuse me, are you Dr. Delaney? Oh, oh Spider-Man, my nemesis. You won't catch me this time. <coughs> oh no, smoke. Whatever will I do? This is the end for you, Spider-Man. Which one is the real man? <laughs> No, I have you. Hey, what's wrong with you? I worked on that helmet for a week. I need to find Dr. Delaney. He's out in the party somewhere. Who are you? I'm your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. <laughs> Smart ass. Throwing down candy could be Dr. Delaney. Gotta find a way up there. I'm looking for Isaac Delaney. I think he's on the dance floor. There he is. 
The lizard in the lab coat. Hey, look, it's Spider Boy. Is this someone of your nemesis? We gotta uh, fight. Maybe later. Oh, what's the matter, Spider Whip? You afraid of my mighty horn? Hey, who? What are you? Come on! Hey! Uh, fight! Uh, Kick fight. his ass, Spider-Man! What the hell? Oh, snap! Oh my god! What do you want? Just tell me what you want! This is a joke, right? Those aren't real guns. Back, now! <laughs> Let him go! <laughs> Keep your head down! Everybody okay? Yeah. Good. Uh, happy Halloween. How about some mood lighting? Where'd they take Delaney? recently began working with someone in an Oscorp lab. How do, you, how do you know that? We don't have much time, Isaac. Tell me his name.
show's over, Lee. Apparently the show's not over. His name, Dr. Morgan Michaels. Thank you. That's all of them. Gotta find Lee. Yuri, I need your help. I've got reports of shots fired at ESU. Yeah, that's me. I'll explain later. But right now, you need to find a Dr. Morgan Michaels. Martin Lee's coming after him. Copy that. Spider-Man, who is this Dr. Michaels? I think he's the head scientist on this Devil's Breath project. Did you find him? Yes and no. Sable says they have him under protection at a safe house somewhere in the city, but they won't tell me where. I thought you guys were working together. So did I. Okay. I have an idea on how to find him. I'll let you know if it works. Hey, did you 
you find Dr. Delaney at the party? Yeah, but so did Lee. Oh no, what happened? Lee corrupted him and made him kill himself. That's horrible. We have to stop this guy. We will. Before Delaney died, he gave Lee a name. Morgan Michaels. Morgan Michaels? Who is he? Not sure, but I bet he works on the Devil's Breath project. Have you learned anything from that Devil's Breath file? Yeah, get this. A few years ago, Osborne came to Fisk and asked him to build a lab, but to keep it hidden from regulators. Secret lab? For Devil's Breath? If it's as dangerous as we think it is, I can see why. Where's the lab? That's not in the file. Osborne made Fisk destroy all records of it. All I have are invoices from Osborne's personal account to Fisk Construction. Knowing Fisk, he kept the invoices around for blackmail material on the mayor. Everything leads back to Norman Osborne. Guess it's time to pay him a visit. I doubt he's gonna tell you anything. Wasn't planning to ask. Today I learned I'm a terrible pigeon wrangler. 1030, be advised. Masked suspects are attacking an armored car. Location is Cathedral. Missed a call from Aunt May. Peter, I spoke to Miles' mother, and she loved the idea of him working here. Oh, the poor woman's grieving herself while trying to be strong for her son. She needs some time to just grieve, and he needs to see that life's still worth living. That was a very thoughtful suggestion, Peter. The kind that would have made Ben proud. Okay, that's how I can get into Norman's office. Can't get in there without shutting down some security systems. But if they see me, they'll put the whole place on lockdown. I should be able to hack into the security network modules from the outside. There are the network cables. Just need to follow them to the security module. There we go, a security module. Looks like there's four of these around the building. That should make things easier. What the hell? Security teams, call in. Sable Team Alpha standing by. Looks like an electrical problem. Copy that. Keep an eye on the exterior while we try to track down the issue. Just when I thought it would be easy. Stable teams. Looks like we have some sort of software problem. We're calling in a specialist. Copy that. Continuing exterior sweep. What? All agents. Someone's taking control of one of our subsystems. Initiating Delta protocol. Man, everybody's got drones these days. Stable teams. I need a status report. Exterior sweep negative. We are all clear. Still look like a software issue? We don't know. We're evaluating. Please maintain current alert level. Attention all Sable teams. There's a small possible. Damn it. Another subsystem is going offline. I need a team to scan the 85th floor exterior. Copy control. Bird inbound. Gotta move. Hi, MJ. A little busy right now. I'll be quick. Listen, I got a lead on Charles Standish's location. I think if I can get to him, I can make him talk. He knew about Dr. Delaney. He probably knows about Morgan Michaels as well. Okay, just don't do anything crazy. Nice. Now I can get into Norman's office and hopefully find out more about Morgan Michaels and Devil's Breath. Exterior sweep negative. Should we go on lockdown? Not yet. Mr. Osborne is in the middle of an important call, but keep tracking. There must be someone out there. Hold on. Switching to a secure line. I'm way ahead of you, Wilson. I had my people go through all your files. If you try to expose our business arrangement, it'll be your word against mine. And I'm not the one behind bars right now. Wait. Is Norman talking to Wilson Fisk? Neo Statue. What are you talking about? The Neo Statue from the auction house. 
They must be talking about that file MJ found. Jackpot. GR27. Hmm. Dr. Morgan Michaels is the chief scientist, but the location of the lab is redacted. AI-controlled CRISPR? If that actually works, it could cure any genetic disease. Cystic fibrosis? Huntington's? This is crazy. Creepy. Whoa. GR-27 is devil's breath. It's designed to cure diseases, but in its current form, it's like a bioweapon. Dr. Michaels keeps the only sample with him at all times. That's why Lee wants him. We find Michaels, we find devil's breath. Hey Pete, what's up? MJ, get this. Devil's Breath wasn't designed to be a weapon. It's a treatment for genetic disorders. But its current form is wildly imperfect. In trying to fix the body, it rips it apart. We need to locate Dr. Michaels. I don't trust Sable to contain something this deadly. I may have a lead on that. Charles Standish is being held at Sable's Central Park compound. If anyone knows Michaels' location, it'll be Oscorp CFO. I'm trying to reach him now. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Sneaking into a Sable compound? That could go bad fast. I should head to Central Park. Looks like Doc checked in. Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Take me, for example. A mind of unlimited potential, shackled to a tired, old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired putterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach into imagination and possibility. Reach into the mind. I've never heard Doc this excited by a project. Hope he's not too excited. Where are you, MJ? Crap. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Standish is somewhere in there. Gotta get past that guard. Time to see if these lures Pete gave me work. That gap in the fence looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. Out of the way, Phil. <laughs> Gotta move. Now. Gonna check on our house guest. Stay here. Copy. House guest. Must be Standish. He's here somewhere. What's that? Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Standish is in real danger. I should get a photo of this. Got it. Time to move. Standish. I knew it. 
I've got to get to that tent. Standish is secure, ma'am. Lockout comms as well. I do not want leaks to press about Michael's or Devil's breath. On it. She's nervous. Stand it. Crap. Generator tripped. I won't distract him for long. How's it looking? Convoy gonna be ready? Five by five. As soon as boss gives the word, we'll get Michael's moved to the new safe house. They're moving him. Have to find out where before we lose our shot. units. He carries the only sample of Devil's Breath. I will not be responsible for pandemic. What was that? Looks important. The safe houses. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. I should grab another photo. Perfect. Gotta move. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devils around the room with him. Again? Control, grid's clear. Repeat, grid's clear. Almost there. Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne does Again? What's up with these lights? Move it. <sighs> Close. Come on, come on. Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. He wants to kill me? 
You tell him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. What's that? I've heard your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Charles! Oh! What the that hell? was not a Sable guy. Definitely not a Sable guy. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. <laughs> well, that was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. I'm not getting much coverage. I should look for more towers to activate. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. You knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you've got is sorry, Charlie? Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I screwed up. It was a tension breaker. Tension breaker? Great. You know, this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military... You know what? Can we not do this right now, please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? <sighs> Fine. Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still mad. Peter. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. Man, I'm worked up. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol. Mom. Hello? Mr. Parker? It's Rio Morales. I want to thank you for getting Miles to drop at the feed shelter. Glad to. And please, call me Peter. Mr. Parker is probably someone more together than me. I should tell you, he has reservations. I finally gave him a choice. This or more therapy. He needs this. He just hates to feel like a victim or be pitied. Gotcha. I'm the same way. I'll let Aunt May know, and I'll make sure I'm there his first day. Thank you again. This means a lot to both of us. Keep fighting the good fight, man. You 
You ought to check that Oscorp research station. I heard there's a rumor there's radioactive stuff in them. I'll see what's going on. Oh, man. Thanks. This is Stable Control. What's the situation south of Houston? APC Oscar under fire. It's the demons. I've got my problems with Sable International, but when they're fighting demons, we're on the same side. Those Sable guys don't like me, so imagine how much I don't like you! Peter, I'm about to begin another test. Oh, sorry. My bus broke down and, uh, there were no cabs. But I'll be there as soon as I can. Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Looks like I could optimize this power relay. Nice. Okay, what next? It looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit. Finished. The signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag.
I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter. I'd call that a mild success. I'd call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... it can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Ah, uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future. I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Hmm. Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but I can tell. He's seen my twitch, noticed the decay of my fine motor control. Well, I'm the one who wanted a genius for an assistant. Of course he knows. I just need more time. My work can improve millions of lives. Save millions of lives. It can also save my own. I just need more time.
Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but... Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours.